I wanted to ask, like, how do you quantify inclusion if that's if you're if you're seeking as diverse and, and inclusive of an organization as you possibly can have? Yeah, I think that's one of the things that we as organizational psychologists are really trying to build a science around. So we know how to count the numbers of different kinds of people so we can get a good sense of diversity from a numeric perspective. Uh, but when it comes to inclusion, that is a psychological construct. It's not something that can easily be counted. So we have, we as organizational scholars have developed a variety of measures, um, mostly items that capture different aspects of those feelings of belongingness and uniqueness and having voice and being treated fairly. So there's a variety of measures that exist in the scholarly literature. There's also some put out by uh, practice-oriented institutions like the Society for Human Resource Management, um, who, like us, make recommendations about the kinds of things we should be measuring. And that often make, means we have to directly ask people, how are you feeling about these things? So we can't assume from an external perspective how anybody's feeling. And so we can use these survey-based items. We could also do things like exit interviews, or we could do focus groups to get a sense of how people are feeling in different parts of organizations. Uh, so there's lots of different ways to go about uh, assessing inclusion. Um, and there's no one gold standard. And they're all pretty highly intercorrelated. So if you measure it one way, you're going to find that it's pretty similar to measuring it in a different way.